Hello everyone. Welcome to Circuit Globe. I am Roshni and in this session we will be discussing what is LED. So friends, let's get started. LED is the short form used for light emitting diode. Let's have a look at the symbol of LED. LED is basically a PN junction diode that has the ability to emit or give off light when certain voltage is applied to its terminals. In the symbolic representation of LED, we can clearly see that its symbol is almost similar to a normal diode. But the only variation which we can see is the two outward arrows. The two arrows used to represent the emission of radiation through LED. Now friends, Let's move further and understand the construction of light emitting diodes. Light emitting diodes are basically formed when P type semiconductor material is merged with an N type semiconductor material. But let me make it very clear that LEDs are not formed using silicon or germanium as their basic material. Instead of that we use gallium arsenide, gallium arsenide phosphide or gallium phosphide as its basic material at the time of LEDs fabrication. The reason to use these materials is that these exhibit special property through which they emit energy in the form of photons rather than in the form of heat. We can see in the figure shown here that the whole structure is enclosed in an epoxy resin hemispherical shell. The reason to use this shell is to have maximum radiation emission from top surface of the LED. Also during emission some part of light reaches the lower portion of the structure. So we use a gold film which is showing cathode connection over here to have sufficient reflection from the bottom of the surface. This is the reason why we achieve maximum radiation emission from top surface of the LED. Let's now move further and understand the working of light emitting diodes. A light emitting diode works on the principle of electroluminance. Now the question arises what is electroluminance? So it is the special property of a semiconductor material that converts electrical energy applied to its terminal into its light equivalent form and this is the basis of working of a light emitting diode. An LED is a forward bias device. This means it operates when forward voltage is applied to it. And we know that a device is set to be in forward biased condition when positive potential of the battery is connected to P side and negative potential of the battery is connected to N side. So the electrons in the N side gets repelled by the negative terminal of the battery and holes in the P side experiences repulsion from the positive potential of the battery. Due to this repulsion the electron starts moving from conduction band to valence band. During their movement electron emits some form of energy and combines with the holes. This emitted energy is in the form of photons due to the property of material from which LED is fabricated. Now the question arises why electron emits light? We know that conduction band is present at higher energy state as compared to valence band and the electrons are present in the conduction band. So during their movement they emit some form of energy in order to come to the valence band and combine with the holes present over here. So this is the reason why radiation is emitted when we apply positive potential to the LED. Now friends let's have a look at the characteristic curve of an LED. Here the figure shows the curve between forward voltage applied to the device and the current that flows through the device on application of voltage. We can say that the current that flows through the device depends on the forward voltage and thus generating light through the diode. Here the different color of curves shows the light that is emitted by the diode. It is noteworthy here that the color emitted by the LED depends on the type of material from which it is constructed. Well friends, 
this brings me to the end of this lesson i hope you find this lesson very useful so guys please like and share this video and put in your comments below and do subscribe our channel for more updates i'll be back with a new lesson till then take care bye bye